Hello everyone. I finally got a printer. I am so happy about that. And so I made me some thank you cards to give out to people because I needed some. And I thought I would put them up in the store. So I wanted you to see how they looked. They come with their own envelope that matches. And you just cut down the middle. And if you have borders on yours, you can cut them off. But, or leave them, whatever you want to do. But I would suggest you cut them off because there's no border in the middle here. I just use my guillotine cutter, but you can use whatever cutter you have. And then these, they kind of look like this. Let me show you. They kind of like this. Let me get a little darker for the camera. There you go. And I just take my cutter and go down each side, the bottom, the top. And all I have to cut by hand is that little curve. And it works really good. And then you have this right here. You fold it up to that line right there. If you hold it up in the light, you might be able to see that line. You should be able to. And then you just press down. And then you're going to want Um, whatever glue you have, you can do a bead glue or a stick glue or whatever that you like to do paper with. And I just use the regular printer paper for the envelope, but you could use cardstock if you want. And then just go down each side. I probably should move my cards. I'll get glue all over them. Okay, so on each side. Make sure you get enough. You don't want your card coming apart in the middle or however you do it. And so let me just give to somebody in person. Or stick on a table at church. Whatever. And there's plenty of room to go in. I made sure that we... I'm not sure if there would be plenty of room with cardstock. I don't know if it makes a difference. But it works really well with regular printer paper. Usually a card maker, but I wanted to have some that I could just print up anytime I needed them. I didn't want to have to go back to the store over and over and over. So here we go. I'm going to just fold it that, and it has a cute little flower thing. And then you just put another thing of glue there. And I'm not going to do that because I have it written on this way. That's how you do it, and it has your um, address and return address right there. So you just put you a stamp on it. Voila. And that's what I'm gonna do. Isn't that beautiful? I love it. Hope you enjoyed this, and check out this listing. There are eight cards and eight envelopes. And yeah, that's what I got. See you later. Bye bye.